Life and shit, top five. Our favorite places. What would you say is your top two favorite places? So, I'm always going to ask you this. Are we talking In the about world. In the world? <laughs> My top two favorite places in, in the world. world. Man, that's tough. Because I haven't been everywhere. Well, it has this to will be change. somewhere you've been. Yeah, this will change. Mm-hmm. So don't quote me on this. Though. Well, I, gotta, I mean, it's just for I, now. But I just don't want nobody to come back and say, well, I remember when you said this was your top two. People and change. change. It's, 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 hey. All right. So uh, one of my favorite places was Tahiti. Okay. Um, Tahiti was pretty dope. Is that on your list? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Tahiti was pretty dope. The only thing about Tahiti that mm-hmm. was not dope is we didn't look at what season we were going to be in Tahiti because mm-hmm. it's in the Southern Hemisphere. Right. And we went to Tahiti in August, mm-hmm. which and is their winter. Uh-huh. And when we got there, you were like, I don't know why I didn't calculate that. Yeah. <laughs> that was my bad. That was totally my bad. I, <laughs> so we had nothing but swimsuits and tank tops and shorts and little dresses. And it rained cats and dogs. The whole thing. And it was not even we just. We didn't have it was little cold. dresses. Oh, well. We didn't have little oh, dresses. I you had, had little dresses. Dress, less. And it was cold as hell. And I literally wore probably the same jeans and, and T-shirt the whole time. Or and, sweater. And sweater. my sweater. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you wore my sweater the whole time because it rained and it was cold. But it was a great experience. It taught me, do your research. Yes. Do your research and you'll have an even better time. We were so busy, though. It was like, okay, we're going to Tahiti. We're going to Tahiti. And then we're like, all right, we're going to Tahiti. We're like, oh, shit. Like, we we didn't think about it. Nah, I think we just too caught up in the fact that it was like Tahiti. Yeah. It's Tahiti. (laughs) It's a French Polynesian. Nothing could go wrong there (laughs) except for rain. (laughs) And cold, <laughs> and them turning off the water at seven o'clock and every turning night. Off the water because at seven there was o'clock. a water shortage. Like we yeah. didn't know because well, it's the winter season. Yeah, so yeah, that's what happens in Tahiti <laughs> in the winter. In August, they turn the water off. <laughs> but other than that, it was gorgeous. It was great. <laughs> so that's number one. Uh, my second favorite place is Puerto Vallarta. I ah, love Puerto okay. Vallarta. Okay, that, that was a pretty dope mm-hmm. little city. Yeah, it was. Everything about it was. Dope. What was your favorite part of that? Um, the people. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like it was a good vibe there, all the way around. Yeah, True. all the way around. True. People who work I, I, there, people who live there. Yeah, the, even the travelers. Like everything about it was dope. Okay, so my favorite places is Italy, definitely. Like mm-hmm. off the top, right? You already know that when we first went to um, Italy, I, I just. I absolutely fell in love with it. Um, we actually went to a part that had um, a lot of Americans. So I think that's what kind of gave it a different kind of a feel. Uh, it felt at home, but not at home. Uh, very friendly, very open, um, so free. I, I loved everything about there. Um, and we just recently went to Tulum, and Tulum was amazing. I, I didn't think it was going to be as beautiful as it was. I didn't think there was as much there um i i would say i would definitely go back there maybe mm-hmm. not to the same place that we were but i would go back to see because there's so much more to see that we didn't think that we it's had funny seen that there. you say you wouldn't oh, go back to the same yeah. place because, <laughs> oh yeah I, i'm gonna beat that one up because you beat you beat me up that me not being so tactful all and right so yes the hotel said we hope you come back will you come back and i said no no and I was like, "Are you seriously?" Like, the look on their face, like, "Wait, what?" Huh? I mean, I'm guessing, I'm guessing they're used to people saying, "Yes, of course, we'll come back." Yeah, this is awesome. It wasn't a bad place. No, the place was cool. We just probably wouldn't stay there again. And that's that was it. <laughs> and I just told them that, <laughs> like, "Yo, there's a lot more opportunity here. I'm not coming back here ever." But you know, it's but cool. You've learned since then to be a little more tactful. And say, I learned that I'm going to say the same exact thing <laughs> if somebody say, hey, are you going to come back? I'm going to say, no. no, I'm not gonna. no. You can meet me. Like the people that work there, I'm like, yo, you're pretty cool. <laughs> you can meet me over here at the other place. Hey, they I'm were pretty at. cool. They're like, anytime you come back to the room, hit me up. Like, you don't have to stay here because your husband already said you're not going to stay here. But <laughs> Exactly. So Tulum in Italy? Yes. And then together? What's our spot together? Palm Springs or Palm Desert? Palm de- the desert period. The desert, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. we live in an ocean uh-huh. next to an ocean. Yes. The, oh, ocean, yeah. uh, the desert. Uh, that's an iffy one. The desert and the mountains. I feel like we're mm-hmm. like. Mm-hmm. I think it's just because we have freedom there. It's the there. Both yeah. are the places where we have the most freedom, and um, we generally turn off our phones and disconnect and. 
do absolutely nothing and also like a lot of creativity and a lot of creative things so Very true. yeah so, super dope right. yeah this is life and shit danny and tommy's top five